welcome back um, to our awesome opportunity that we get to continue to have, which is our virtual fitness classes. So this is Butt and Guts, exactly like the name. We are going to be focusing on our upper body groups, which is more of like our core section, yes with our rectus abdominis, our lower abs, and our oblique muscles. And then we will be also focusing on our lower body. So really focusing on our glutes, glutes, medius, and minimus, as well as hamstrings, quads, and calves. So be ready to fire those up. We will have a warm up section, which will be targeting both of our muscle groups. So we are all set for the class. And then we will also be doing a, just a section for our guts and for our butts. So, woo um, So thank you so much for joining me. So we're gonna start out with our warm up. Are you guys ready? Thumbs up. Woo woo! All right, let's get started with our warm up. All right, marching out right here. We're gonna get our lower body. We're gonna get energy up into all our muscle groups. Woo woo! Have fun, now just remember, if I go too fast, please take it at your own pace. This is your own workout, so have fun. Three, two, step touch. You're gonna go to left, right. Right here, feel free to pump your arms however you would like. Please 
Repeat with that same. 
are killing it. Um, we are going to have three exercises, same thing, but we are going to really target the full lower body. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. We are going to start out with like a bar flow uh, to target our lower body. So we're going to side lunge, feel free, bring those arms in. We're going to tap, then we're going to activate that, those glutes. So spicing the side, you're going to open your arms and feel free if you want to tap or go back to passe. That's up to you. You're going to go side lunge, tap, release the glutes, and passe or tap, okay? And we're going to go for just eight, but if you want to go slower, feel free. Again, we're going to activate our glutes medius and our glutes maximus and a little bit of our balance. Now, the next exercise, we're going to do our curtsy lunge. So step with the right foot, bring back the left. Hips are going to be going to the diagonal, curtsy lunge. And we're going to squat, repeat to the other side. Now, you will have the option to the fifth one, if you would like to do a squat calf raise or a little squat jump, that's up to you. That gets your endurance up a little bit more. My main goal for you for form is knees are over your toes, okay? No matter what, all right? And be focused on your hips. Yes, when we do the curtsy lunge. Now the last one, you will be coming to the ground, so make sure you have a soft surface, but we're gonna do a side lying kick. Your right arm's gonna be over, left arm's gonna be right near your chest. You're gonna lift up your right foot, you're gonna go forward, inhale, exhale back. Now these are amazing for your um, um, abductors as well as your glutes medius. It's perfect, I highly suggest to do these every night. They're perfect for your glutes medius because they protect your hips. All right guys, so that's our first round and then we'll do it again to the second round. Yeah, are you guys ready? Woo woo! All right, let's go for it. All right, you know this song? Sing along, it's gonna power us through, so let's crush it. All right, we're gonna do the side lunge. Bring it back, pause or stop. Five, six, seven, side lunge. Bring it back, glute raise, back up, again. Lunge. And hit back, activate those glutes. And exhale. And back. And breathe in. Exhale. Lift those glutes. Pause it. Good. Yes. All right. Last one. Woo. Good work, team. All right, now the next one, we're going to be doing our curtsy lunge. Squat. Ready? Three, two, one. Step right. Curtsy lunge. And squat. Knees over toes. Raise those glutes. Again. Woo! This is our third one. Good. Feel free to get your own pace. At least one jump if you would like. Oops. Okay. Nice. All right. Can you just give me two more? Last one. Woo! Yes, that is your second exercise. Can you lay down onto the ground? If you don't want to lay on the ground, feel free. Hold on to a chair and move your legs forward and back. But if you would like, join us to the ground. All right, so right arm.
bring it in and lift out. I'll start with the modified and then I'll pop up to the full, um, a little extra option if you would like. All right, I'll guide it through, don't worry, but are you guys ready? Woo woo! Let's fire up the abs. All right. If we have time, we'll go back through um, one of the exercises in each section. All right, lay on to your um, back. Find your natural curves. So you should feel all your natural curves. Take a deep breath in. Big exhale. All right, we're gonna lift our palms up. Breathe in, lift up. Guide to your right foot. And left, that makes one, two, Three, good. Four. Exhale. Inhale. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Good. Lower down. Inhale. On your exhale, raise up to tabletop. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Lift the sternum. Ten toe touches. Up. One. Two. Lower abs are working. Lower those legs as far as your hips will feel comfortable with, okay? Add an extra challenge, lift up that sternum. Give me four, three, two, one. Bring it back up to tabletop. All right, we're gonna drop that right foot. Activate that lower abs. Drop it down. Good. Lift up those. 
Keep using that breath flow so we can really, really activate those muscles. Let them contract. Yes. All right, four more.
our upper body and our lower body. Next uh, week, we'll be doing the same um, format until uh, the next week. After that, we'll have a completely new set, okay? So we'll, I'll add a little bit of an extra challenge um, this week so we can continue to grow in each exercise. So whenever you're ready, just meet me onto the ground, crisscross, or whatever you would like. All right, take a deep breath in, just right here. And big exhale. Last one, take a deep breath in. And big exhale. We're gonna incorporate the arms, inhale. And big exhale. Last one, breathe in. And exhale. We're gonna go towards the right side, your right side. Inhale. Big exhale, one more time, breathe in, exhale. All right, face flat, we're gonna go to the other side, breathe in, big exhale, good job. Last one, inhale, and exhale, good. All right, we are going to be opening out our feet. They're gonna be a little bit over hip width apart, this is going to be a good um, stretch for your core. So this is the seated spine stretch that we do in Pilates. So you're going to breathe in. Exhale, contract and look down. Back up through. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Inhale. And exhale. One more. Inhale. And exhale. All right, we're gonna go to the right side. This is our saw. We're gonna go inhale. Guide towards your pinky toe on your foot. Inhale, look at your back hand. Exhale, come back. We're gonna switch to the other side. Inhale, exhale, look at your back hand. Inhale, back. One more time on each side, inhale, exhale. Back up. Last one. Inhale and exhale. Good work. All right, whenever you're ready, position yourself onto all fours into quadruped position. We are going to drop our sternum into cat and cow to stretch our core out a little bit. So take a deep breath in, look up, and exhale, curl through. Good. And inhale. And big exhale. All right, we're gonna do two more of the same breath flow. Inhale, exhale. Last one, inhale, and exhale. All right, neutral back. We're gonna go into downward dog, so push those balls of your feet into the mat and ground. Lift that tailbone up into our downward dog. All right, take a deep breath in. If you would like, exhale, plow through those feet. So just lift one heel and alternate to the next. This can be fast, this also can be slow. Good work, you guys. Give me three, and two, and one. Good, press those heels in. All right, we're gonna walk those feet towards your hands. I'm gonna make myself back to front to face to you. We're gonna bend those knees, grab those elbows, and swing side to side for me. Good, three, two, one. We're gonna roll up, breathe in, look up. Big exhale, T. We're gonna go into the right side. Well, this is your left side. I'll face your right side, my bad. Ah, oh, forget Mary. Um, so inhale, big exhale, straighten this knee if you would like. This is just a deeper oblique stretch. From here, lift. We're gonna position ourselves into warrior one. Big inhale, big exhale. Bring both feet together, sit into your hip, flex your right foot. Good, inhale and exhale. Position 
back out to a T, other side. Inhale, and exhale, straighten. Really, really reach. Inhale, and big exhale. Reach up with that oblique, flip to warrior one. Push those hips forward. Breathe in. Exhale, bring the feet together. Sit into that hip, flex that left foot for me. Good work. Bring it back to center. Last stretch. Feel free if you need to find a wall or a chair, or if you feel comfortable doing it um, in place, we're gonna lift our right quad and our heel to our glute. Push those hips forward. Good quad stretch. Take a deep breath in. Big exhale. And drop. Other side. Breathe in. And exhale. Arms up. And exhale. All right. Give yourself a round of applause. Good work, you guys. Thank you so, so much for joining me back. Good work today. Woo! Stay healthy and happy. You're welcome. Thank you. Good to see you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Thank you, Allison. Thank you, Danny.